thing because like all that they'll promote on the news, uh, you know, they're notor notorious for putting stuff up there about mm -hmm. our people. Yes. Um, that's not meant to make us look mm -hmm. good at all, especially the, the young men. Mm -hmm. um, now you'll go and see, and uh, even as our people share it, mm -hmm. uh, understanding when is the right time to share it, and uh, am I supposed to share this? You know, asking yourself the questions. Um, uh, most importantly, taking them to Yahuwah, you know, taking these questions and asking them, is this meant for me to share? You know, can I uh, warn my people about things like this without it being uh, premature, mm -hmm. uh, without it being too late, without it being just out of season and, and not, you know, meant for me to do so? It's like, mm -hmm. am I meant to encourage them, you know, don't pay attention to that, or am I supposed to draw their attention to it? Mm -hmm. And so, um, just making sure that people do the research, you know, uh, if you don't have, you know, the mental and, and uh, emotional stability mm -hmm. to, to research things mm -hmm. like this, then I would advise not to, right. you know, if you're easily <laughs> able to get, uh, uh, if you have anxiety attacks, you know, that's nothing that you need to research. Mm -hmm. or. If you're someone who takes this all, you know, emotionally in and you don't know how to properly release it, you'll find yourself mm -hmm. um, either really wanting to help your people to the point where it's hurtful to you or you'll just want to push your own people away and mm -hmm. not really want to deal with them at all because it seems like, well, all I see is they being promoted as being hostile and, you know, out for my blood. And so, um, usually wisdom in what we do, caution, um, mm -hmm. prayer, mm -hmm. prayer, prayer above all, yes. and making sure that... <laughs> You know, that if we have issues with this, knowing that we have, you know, we can trust our brothers and sisters mm -hmm. and that not all of them are out there, mm -hmm. you know, wanting to hurt us and wanting That's to right. do harm That's to right. us. Mm -hmm. Knowing that we do have brothers and sisters we can lean on mm -hmm. and, you know, say, hey, well, you know, I saw this on the news and it kind of, you know, unsettled my, uh, my heart, you know, and unsettled my emotions and mm -hmm. I wasn't sure what to do with it. And the right people in your corner and the right people there. You know, being that shoulder for you will tell you, well, you know, you can just, turn, you know, turn off the TV and study Torah. You know, you don't have to meditate on those things mm -hmm. because just as you can meditate on Torah and get the information from that and mm -hmm. then be empowered by that, you can also receive and be um, influenced through what you see on TV. And mm -hmm. it's not, uh, it won't be a good impact in your mm -hmm. life or, you know, it won't be provoking you to do what the Torah will provoke you to do. So it's like... Well, I shouldn't meditate on that because it'll cause you to be unsettled in, uh, in your soul. It'll cause you to be unsettled in your mm -hmm. thinking. That's right. And you'll find yourself being um, unable to process how you need to. And it won't be at all effective for those around mm -hmm. you, for your community, uh, for your body. Um, it will actually start to bother your health. And so mm -hmm. just being cautious of what we do mm -hmm. and, and who we allow to see what we're doing. Mm -hmm. um, and making sure that we're aware of what audience, you know, we are sharing this That's with. Right. Mm -hmm. That's and, right. And uh, making sure that we ourselves are able to handle it and those around us are able to handle it. If mm -hmm. not, then it's just best to back up and, you know, dust your hands up and it's like, you know, Yahuwah, well, I give it to you. And, you know, mm -hmm. those that are able to handle it and do something about it mm -hmm. instead of trying to put myself in that position to be um, emotionally troubled and distressed and, mm -hmm. and just off balance and, you know, it's unnecessary. Mm -hmm. but, be cautious and study and mm -hmm. uh, don't allow these things to, to cause you to disregard your worth as a people. Mm -hmm. And thank you so much. And once again, I'm going to put the links to their channels inside of the bio so you can go and subscribe to these two beautiful young ladies. Uh, my sister and my Mora, their channels are very worth subscribing to because we're talking and we're trying to make a difference and we're thriving to make a difference. This isn't just something that we're doing because, oh, we have the time and it's just something that's on the top of our heads. No, this is something that's crucial for our people to really mentally get themselves together mm -hmm. because as a people, we need to be able to look to one another because we're understanding that we're getting the information and the news that we do have from a predominantly European structure um, media. Mm -hmm. And so if we don't have a indigenous Hebrew, uh, we don't have a colored media, every time we get the news about our people, mm -hmm. it's going to be uh, discriminated. It's going to always right. be uh, tailored to, um, to uh, demonize us in some sort of way mm -hmm. um, more than what it's supposed to be. So you always want to make sure that if you have a source of people that have information and they are melanated, you understand that it's not biased and you understand that you're getting information for your, um, your, your safety. And so uh, once again, I'm going to put the information inside of the description. I thank you more, Triple Seven. I thank you, Yasmin Brown, for uh, being featured on my channel.